what's up? This is Prachi and in today's video, I'll be talking about something which is very, very exciting for me. So if you've been following me on Instagram, you might be aware that very recently I picked up a new vlogging camera for myself and I'm so excited about this one. The camera is Nikon Z50, which is the latest mirrorless camera in the Z series by Nikon. And ever since it was launched, international vloggers can't stop raving about it, guys. If you actually see on YouTube, international vloggers have been calling it the best vlogging camera ever. So, you know, like last week I was actually traveling in Goa and I wanted to actually film a vlog. But my current DSLR camera, like most DSLR cameras, it's so huge, so bulky, it's very difficult to carry around and work with or hold for long hours. This camera, on the other hand, is actually designed very, very well for such purposes. If you just want something easy, light, compact. So yes, that's what I'm talking about in today's video. I'll be showing you my new camera, which I have finally got my hands on because it has launched in India and I'm so excited about it. Just keep watching this video, guys, if you want to find out more. So let's start with a quick unboxing. Here I have with me the Nikon Z50 camera body, of course. And uh, we also have the DX1650 lens. It comes with a user's manual for anybody who's new to cameras or who just wants to know how to use this camera perfectly. Also, it's very easy to use. I'll talk about that a little bit more in detail later. It also comes with a battery, a battery charger, a camera holding strap, a USB cable. So basically, whatever you need to get started. However, I would definitely recommend also getting the FTZ mount adapter for your Nikon lenses because obviously it'll just come in very, very handy. Now, if you're a vlogger, whether on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, any social media platform, guys, this is a very, very good camera. It's absolutely ideal because one of the biggest challenges that I personally face while using my DSR cameras is that they're so huge and bulky. They're just very difficult to carry around. This camera, on the other hand, is small, compact, lightweight, easy, and very, very efficient to use. It gives you a very firm grip, which makes it very easy to use even when you're walking around, moving around, and the flip screen actually comes right at the bottom of the camera instead of on the side. So for example, right now, when I'm making this video, I'm looking at the camera lens. If I look at the screen, the connection breaks, right? You see me looking on the side. In this case, because the screen is just right underneath the lens, I can blink and look at the screen and you'll not even realize. It doesn't break your connect with the camera. You can look at the screen whenever you want, which often happens with vloggers. Like when I am vlogging, I need to keep looking at the screen to make sure that the camera is still rolling, uh, to see that the lights lights are being handled well, especially if I'm using an autofocus mode and all of those things. So it's just basically very, very ideal for vlogging or for anybody looking for a light, easy, compact camera to work with. Now talking about the camera quality and features, well, let me start by telling you that this is the first DX mirrorless camera by Nikon, which also gives you a 4K recording. The YZ mount for the lens allows more light, which basically leads to more sharpness, contrast, focusing speed, better low light performance, and an overall great image quality. Also, let me show you this. It has a touchscreen feature, guys, which is so, so useful, especially for beginners. I remember personally when I got my first DSLR camera, I was wildly confused on how to use the camera. I was so, so, so confused with the various buttons and how to navigate through things. It can actually be very overwhelming. However, when you have a touchscreen option, it's actually much easier to pick up on how to use the camera, how to work with it. And also while vlogging, when you're actually holding the camera in one hand and doing something else with the other hand, you need the camera to be very easy to work with. So you can just touch the screen and just change whatever you need to change and everything. On that note, let me also actually tell you that it has amazing autofocus option, great eye detection, great face detection. So whenever you are actually filming the, you know, again, whenever you're filming the videos yourself or taking pictures yourself, you need your camera to be very, very intelligent because nobody's helping you do that. I think with most vloggers, this actually applies, including for myself. A lot of times I'm actually filming my own videos on my own. So for those times, I need the camera to be very intelligent, to be able to tell where my face is, where my eyes are and just start you know, filming accordingly instead of me having to tell it everything. This camera can do all of those things for you. Apart from that, this camera actually has a lot of Insta-like filters. For example, let me show you, it has 20 inbuilt picture controls that can be used for pictures as well as for videos. So for example, let me show you the selective color option, which is so cool, so creative. Then we have the bokeh option and so on and so forth. So you know, sometimes when I'm taking pictures or taking videos, I'm like, yes, this shot is there, but just not there. Something is missing in this, in this shot. You can actually start playing around with these options. You can see how the different options can actually make the picture come out differently. And 
for all you know you will end up with a beautiful creative shot just like that this camera is definitely designed for anybody who is looking for creative pictures creative videos with minimum possible efforts because you have all your options right there however for all the times when you want a straight up video or a photo well let me tell you the colors are extremely sharp here's a quick comparison shot of my current camera and this camera can you see the difference in colors it has an built white balance which is actually very very intelligently designed once again and really useful so if you have ever done color correction on your videos or on your photos you know that while color correction white balance is very very important because it actually decides how the rest of the colors will look and it can actually go a long way in enhancing your video or your picture quality this camera can do that just for you really really well apart from that it can also do slow motion recording it can also do time lapse video so basically sky is the limit guys you can do so many things with this camera and I am honestly super excited to start using it. Another feature which I think would come in very very handy to all vloggers at least definitely for me I can say this for myself for sure is that this camera also has Wi-Fi options. So whenever you're done taking pictures or videos and you want to start editing or uploading on the go, you can just transfer all the files onto your phone right then and there just like that and start editing, uploading right away. So it's very, very easy, very, very handy to transfer all the files as well. You don't have to carry your laptop and the entire setup to just transfer your files. Another thing talking about the setup, well, of course, this camera, like I just said, comes with a camera battery and a battery charger. But when you're on the go and you want to charge your camera immediately and you don't have access to power points and things like that you can actually use this usb cable to use to use a power bank and charge your camera using a power bank as well this is again very very handy because ever since i started using the dslr cameras i think it's been about eight or nine years since i've been using a dslr camera now ever since uh, i started using dslr cameras i've always carried extra batteries with me fully charged batteries because you never know if you can't charge your camera battery your camera just falls flat you can't use it anymore so using a power bank being able to use a power bank to charge your camera is definitely a very very handy the option as and when required. So guys, that's all I wanted to share in today's video about my new Nikon Z50 camera. The reason why I'm talking about this is because so many of you keep asking me which camera I'm using and which camera should you get started with. And I think this is such a great, impactful camera because you get good quality uh, videos, photos. You saw those in the sample shots as well. They are very easy to work with, very lightweight, very compact, and basically anything that a vlogger would ask for. However, if you're not a vlogger, but if you're just looking for a new camera, like I know a lot of friends who are not vlogging, but who need uh, cameras because when they are vacation on their vacations, holiday trips, you want to take lots of nice pictures and you don't want to take pictures just with your phone. For good quality pictures and videos, you still need a camera which is easy and handy to work with. This is such a perfect camera for those occasions as well. So yes, that's all I wanted to share in today's video. If you want more details, if you want to know more about this camera, I'll put the link in the description box below along with some more details and the features so you can read about it and find out more about it. And yes, that's all I wanted to share, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, turn on the bell icon for notifications, guys. And keep coming back to Superboss Style for more. This is me, Praji, signing off now. Bye-bye.